All right, y'all, we're going to talk about Miss Leslie Inez and Mr. Christopher Sales and his motherfucking video, man. Before we get into it, make sure y'all like it up, comment, subscribe, make sure you hit that bell so you can be notified when I upload on my channel. Make sure you DM me lit reactions to do. And tell a friend to tell a friend to tell they ain't your mama telling Uncle Joey still a ho. Let's get right into this video. Let's get it, man. So, yeah, a lot of you guys were blowing me up in my DMs, letting me know that Leslie dropped a video, okay? And Leslie also posted on her IG story that her mother is her Valentine, her only Valentine, and shit like that, okay? A lot of people had a lot to say, all right? Even some of Christie's supporters were in my DMs. Saying that I need to give my opinion and address the situation, okay? So, a lot of people thought that Chris and Leslie was going to be dropping the amazing video. Amazing is the song that Chris made for Leslie. They shot a music video for it and just have not released it yet, okay? Maybe it's for something special that we don't know about yet. I'm not quite sure. I do know that Leslie is team Pisces, so her birthday must be coming up, all right? So I don't know if possibly Amazing is going to drop on her birthday. We don't know, guys. We don't know. But a lot of people were anticipating Amazing video, official music video dropping on V-Day, Valentine's Day, February 14th, okay? A lot of people were anticipating that they were going to drop that video, okay? It didn't happen. We all know it didn't happen, okay? So, a lot of you guys brought to my attention that it seems as if, it seems, I have to say it seems because we don't really know everything that happens, but a lot of you guys were saying if Chris did send Leslie anything for Valentine's Day, Leslie most likely would have posted it all right and let people know about it not just on youtube but maybe on her ig story something basic okay it didn't have to be publicized on youtube but she probably would have posted whatever chris got her for valentine's day on her instagram story let me know how you guys feel about that do you guys think it's weird that she didn't post anything do you guys think it's weird if Chris did not send Leslie anything, did they get into it? Did they, you know, we don't really know what's going on here, okay? Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Y'all wanted me to react to a little bit of this video. Okay, I believe y'all said something about the beginning of the video or whatever and her mom surprising her and, you know, basically her only Valentine's Day gift coming from her mom. All of this is alleged because I really don't know the facts. Maybe Chris did send her something. We don't know about it. Maybe they're just wanting people to talk about it. We don't know, guys. We really don't know. But without further ado, let's fucking get into it, man. Let's go. What you got, the chocolate? You got the chocolate? What you got, girl? Oh, edible arrangements, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Guys, this is from my mom. Oh, wait. Happy Valentine's Day, Princess. So used to getting me chocolate and leaving it on the bed. Now you're all grown with your own space, and I'm not even there to put the chocolate on your bed. Oh, <laughs> She's all emotional and shit. I can't believe it, but you've made me. Oh my god, girl. Give me a tissue. Oh my me. gosh. But you've made me proud, proud, happy mom. I love you so much. Leslie is so <laughs> sensitive. Oh my gosh. A lot of you guys were like, Chris, how could you? Chris, how could you leave her alone on Valentine's Day? Okay, and if you had to leave her alone or if y'all had to be apart on Valentine's Day, how dare you? 
not get her or send her anything for fucking Valentine's Day, Christopher. Okay. Some of you guys who comment on my videos went on this video commenting, talking, you know, about like, Chris, what the fuck is up, man? What the fuck is up? And Chris did comment on this video, that, which we're going to get into later on. I told her, like, every Valentine's Day, she will always buy me chocolate. My mom always buys me chocolate. She will leave it on top of my bed without saying anything. I always have chocolate. She wrote me a note. So emotional, y'all. Uh, it's cute. So happy. Um, and she was, we were talking on the phone about it. And she was like, I know, and I'm not even there. You know, my mom moved to Florida too, but she was, she was about two hours away. So she still made it. Two hours? Damn. Wow. I love you, Mom. Thank you so much. Shout out to Mommy. Mommy I'm Ines. I'm so happy. Thank you. Thank you. What kind of edible yeah, arrangement is this? This fucking Wi Fi is trash, y'all. Yeah, look how cute are these? And it's that time. Uh -uh. Don't I'm really trying my best to leave this road. So good. Mm -hmm. She tore them motherfuckers yeah. up, yo. She ain't had no help. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. She tore them bitches up, y'all. So, what I really want to get into is the comment section, okay? So, a lot of people, you know, saying, Girl, I missed you. Glad you back and all of this. Sorry you had to be alone on Valentine's Day. Let's see what people had to say when Chris Sell says, Damn, with the hearts around the smiley face. Y'all had a lot to say. Y'all had a lot to say. Boy, why was our wife alone on Valentine's Day? I hope you did something for her, shaking my head. We gonna need more than just hot dams to make up for Leslie being lonely on Valentine's, Chris. You for sure could have sent her flowers, gang. You wrong for that. Oh, hell no. <laughs> oh. Oh, y'all are funny as shit, bro. <laughs> Tessa said, oh, hell no, bitch. Not you in her comments with the hearts all over with the smiley face, bitch. Ain't nothing to smile about. Okay, I put that in there. Why she spent Valentine's Day alone and only received a gift from her mom? No. The nerve, the audacity. Okay, my nigga Puff Plug be coming through. I appreciate you so much. Damn, my ass. Oh, Shit, my bad. I know you ain't mean it like that. Damn my ass, Chris. Why was she by herself? Hip Hop Unboxing says, right. He gonna come on here talking about some damn boy, no. Why was our homegirl alone on Valentine's Day shaking my fucking head? I added the fucking eye note. All right. <laughs> Sylvia comes through under Chris's comment and says, Chris. Have you lost your entire mind? Get your behind on somebody's plane, boat, motorcycle, tricycle, skateboard, monkey. Walk if you have to. Jesus didn't have a problem walking, you got damn right. And go figure this mess out. Every time I put y'all at the bottom of the prayer list thinking y'all are good, I have to bring you up to the top. Heck, I can cash app you. You're fair. Oh shit, she going hard, shout out to Sylvia. And what's the problem? I thought so, at this rate, we might not ever get Bella, which is the baby girl, okay? Y'all know you both have fallen in love. <laughs> no, you didn't want it to happen, but it has, goddammit. So you better make some shit shake. That's what Sylvia said, okay? You both need to lay in each other's arms and cry. Cry because Jesus never left y'all. All right, she went hard, okay? She went motherfucking hard. Sylvia's not playing no fucking games with you, Chris. Okay, I'm just letting you know. I'm just the messenger. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot her either. But anyway. Funny TikToks and more says, calm down. You don't really know what happened. True, we don't know what happened. Maybe she got a fucking 
bouquet of flowers, a little teddy bear. You know, we don't know what the hell she got. Maybe a dildo. We don't know, you know. Uh, don't fuck around on me, but use this dildo while we're not together. We don't know, guys. We really don't know. I'm going to read one more, one more comment. Oh, two more because my nigga Solo Breezy's on here too. Miss Dominguez Lifestyle says, Chris, you need to stop acting stubborn sometimes. We getting older every day. It's time to grow up a bit. We was all hoping y'all were with each other on Valentine's Day, and I don't know how you let her be lonely on that day, Christopher. It really makes us sad. Please don't lose out on your blessings. Leslie is such a sweet and rare soul. Anything would have made her smile. I hope you did something for her, Chris. I really do. My nigga Solo Breezy says, y'all finna get cussed out because why y'all playing with us? Why y'all playing with us, man? No, sir. Leslie better have something for Valentine's Day. I don't give a fuck if the holiday was almost two days ago. You know better than that, Christopher. Come on now. Hey, man. With that being said, that's all I got to say. You don't know what happens behind the scenes. Like I said, she may have got a whole bouquet. I don't know. We really don't know, guys. But what I do know, Chris Lee Gang is looking at you, Christopher. Mr. For Christopher. And is wondering what the fuck is going on. Why does Leslie have to depend on her mother? You know how you say on my mother? Why does Leslie have to depend on her mother to come through for her on Valentine's Day, Christopher? Okay. Why? Why? Okay. Let us know. If you're watching this video, Christopher, let us know in the comment section down below what the fuck is going on here. Okay. What's going on? All right, by all means, come out with a video on your channel, Sales Kid, Chris Sales Channel, whatever you wanna do. You know, make a little explanation video, make your coins, whatever the case may be. At the end of the day, it's none of our business. I wish you the best, Leslie the best, and you never know. At this very moment, they could be fucking sucking, loving. We don't know, guys, we really don't know. So let me know in the comment section down below what you guys feel about Chris not sending anything to Leslie, supposedly. We don't know, allegedly. And how Leslie says that her mother is her Valentine, her only Valentine, and all of that shit, okay? Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. I love you guys so freaking much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell so you be notified when I upload on my channel. Make sure you DM me at the Diamond Life 888 Let me know what I should react to next. And tell a friend and tell a friend until they ain't. Your mom and Teddy, Uncle Joey, still a whole. I will see you guys in the next motherfucking video. Yo, and I love y'all, man. Peace. Y'all, yeah, baby.